Hi there, welcome to the Investing Iguana, the show where I help you make sense of the world of personal finance, investing, and retirement planning. I'm your host, Iggy, and today we're going to talk about why now is a great time for fixed income. Yes, you heard me right, fixed income. The boring, safe, low-return type of investments that most people ignore or avoid. But trust me, there's more to fixed income than meets the eye, and in this video, I'll show you why you should consider adding some fixed income products to your portfolio, especially in the current market environment. But before we dive into the topic, please do me a favor and smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my future videos. And if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below and I'll try to answer them as soon as possible. Alright, let's get started. What is fixed income? Fixed income is a broad term that refers to any type of investment that pays a fixed or predictable amount of interest or income over a period of time. Some common examples of fixed income products are bonds, cash management accounts, and government securities. Bonds are debt instruments issued by governments, corporations, or other entities to raise funds. When you buy a bond, you are essentially lending money to the issuer in exchange for a promise to pay you back the principal amount plus interest at a specified date in the future. The interest rate or coupon rate of a bond is usually fixed and paid periodically until maturity. Cash management accounts are accounts that offer higher interest rates than traditional savings accounts by investing your money in low-risk assets such as money market funds or short-term bonds. Cash management accounts are typically offered by online platforms or robo-advisors that charge low or no fees and provide easy access to your money. Government securities are debt instruments issued by governments or their agencies to finance their spending or debt obligations. Government securities are generally considered to be very safe and liquid investments because they are backed by the full faith and credit of the issuing government. Some examples of government securities are treasury bills, notes, and bonds. In the context of Singapore, government securities take the form of Singapore Government Securities, SGS, and Singapore Savings Bonds, SSB. These are issued by the Monetary Authority of Singapore, MAS, to meet the investment needs of the government and offer citizens a risk-free form of investment. Singapore's stable political climate, robust economy, and strong governance have earned its government securities a high credit rating, making them some of the safest investments in the world. Investing in these financial instruments is increasingly popular among Singaporeans looking for low-risk, long-term investment options. They offer multiple benefits that resonate with the cautious, yet financially savvy, investment culture in the city-state. Firstly, Singapore government securities provide a reliable income stream through periodic coupon payments for those who hold bonds and notes. Secondly, their highly liquid nature makes them easily tradable in secondary markets, enabling investors to convert their holdings into cash swiftly should the need arise. Notably, the Singapore Savings Bonds Program aims to make such securities more accessible to the general public. With low minimum investments and the ability to earn step-up interest rates the longer the bonds are held, this scheme appeals to a broad demographic, from young adults just beginning their investment journey to retirees looking for a stable income. Why is now a great time for fixed income? You might be wondering why I'm talking about fixed income when the stock market is booming and everyone is chasing after high-growth investments like cryptocurrency, NFTs, or meme stocks. Well, the answer is simple, interest rates. Interest rates are one of the most important factors that affect the performance and valuation of different types of investments. And right now, interest rates are on the rise. As you may already know, interest rates have been increasing since late 2021 due to various reasons such as inflation expectations, economic recovery, and monetary policy changes. When interest rates increase, borrowing costs for companies go up. This means that companies have to pay more interest on their loans, which reduces their profits and earnings potential. This can negatively affect their stock prices and valuations. When interest rates increase, future cash flows are discounted more heavily. This means that money in the future is worth less than money today. 
This can also lower the valuation of stocks that rely on future growth prospects rather than current earnings. When interest rates increase, existing bonds lose value. This is because new bonds issued at higher interest rates will offer higher returns than old bonds issued at lower interest rates. This can cause bond prices to fall and bond yields to rise. When interest rates increase, cash management accounts become more attractive. This is because cash management accounts can offer higher interest rates than traditional savings accounts by investing in low-risk assets that benefit from rising interest rates. This can provide a stable and competitive return for your money. As you can see, rising interest rates can have different effects on different types of investments. And while some investments might suffer from higher interest rates, others might thrive or at least hold their ground. This is where fixed income comes in handy. Fixed income can provide several benefits for your portfolio in a rising interest rate environment. Fixed income can provide diversification for your portfolio. By adding some fixed income products to your portfolio, you can reduce your exposure to stocks that might be vulnerable to rising interest rates. Fixed income can also help balance out the volatility and risk of your portfolio by providing more stability and predictability. Fixed income can provide income for your portfolio. By investing in fixed income products that pay regular interest or dividends, you can generate a steady stream of cash flow for your portfolio. This can help you meet your living expenses or reinvest in other opportunities. Fixed income can provide capital preservation for your portfolio. By investing in fixed income products that have low default risk or high credit quality, you can protect your principal from losses or erosion due to inflation. This can help you preserve your wealth and purchasing power. How to invest in fixed income Now that you know why fixed income is a great option for your portfolio, you might be wondering how to invest in fixed income. Well, there are many ways to invest in fixed income, depending on your risk appetite, time horizon, and investment goals. One way to invest in fixed income is to buy individual bonds or government securities directly from the issuers or the secondary market. This way, you can choose the specific bonds or securities that suit your preferences and needs. However, this method can also be costly, complex, and time-consuming as you need to do your own research, analysis, and due diligence on each bond or security. You also need to have enough capital to buy the minimum amount required by the issuers or the market. Another way to invest in fixed income is to use online platforms or robo-advisors that offer cash management accounts or bond funds. This way, you can access a diversified portfolio of low-risk assets that are managed by professionals or algorithms. You can also enjoy lower fees, higher liquidity, and easier access to your money. However, this method can also have some drawbacks, such as lower control, transparency, and customization over your investments. You also need to be aware of the risks and limitations of each platform or robo-advisor, such as credit risk, interest rate risk, liquidity risk, and operational risk. A third way to invest in fixed income is to use a hybrid approach that combines both methods. This way, you can have the best of both worlds, the flexibility and choice of buying individual bonds or securities, and the convenience and efficiency of using online platforms or robo-advisors. You can also adjust your allocation and strategy according to your changing needs and goals. However, this method can also require more effort, knowledge, and monitoring on your part. You also need to be careful not to over-diversify or under-diversify your portfolio. In conclusion, fixed income investments serve as a cornerstone for risk-averse individuals and entities looking for a steady stream of income in Singapore, a nation known for its financial stability and well-regulated investment environment. These investments typically offer a fixed or predictable amount of interest or income over a specific time frame, making them ideal for those who prioritize security and predictability. In the context of Singapore's economic landscape, fixed income securities like Singapore Government Securities, SGS, Singapore Savings Bonds, and Corporate Bonds offer local investors not only the opportunity to diversify their portfolios, but also a shield against the potential volatility in equity markets. 
Singapore, with its AAA credit rating, makes government bonds especially attractive for those looking for almost risk-free investment options. Moreover, the evolving fintech scene in Singapore has made it increasingly convenient to invest in fixed income. Various online platforms and robo-advisors are available to Singaporean investors, offering detailed analytics and strategies to optimize returns on bonds and other fixed income securities. These digital platforms are in line with the Monetary Authority of Singapore's MAS, focus on innovation and financial services, thus ensuring a secure and user-friendly experience for investors. The rising interest rates in Singapore can also make fixed income investments more attractive. Unlike equities, which can be more sensitive to economic fluctuations, fixed income securities can offer capital preservation features that are particularly useful in a rising interest rate environment. Investing in fixed income not only provides a hedge against inflation, but also delivers consistent returns, which can be crucial for retirees and those looking for a stable income. Finally, employing a hybrid approach by mixing individual bonds with mutual funds focused on fixed income can offer the advantage of both customized and expertly managed portfolios. This blended method caters to both savvy investors who wish to take an active role in their investments and those who prefer a more hands-off approach. To sum up, fixed income investments occupy a vital place in Singapore's financial ecosystem, offering diversification, steady income, and capital preservation, qualities highly valued in the Lion City's sophisticated investment landscape. Whether you opt for individual bonds, online platforms, or a mix of both, fixed income in Singapore provides a versatile avenue for achieving various financial goals. If you found this video helpful, please hit that like button. It really helps us to understand what kind of content you want to see more of. And don't forget to subscribe. Here at The Investing Iguana, we're dedicated to helping you navigate your financial journey with confidence and clarity. And guess what? There's plenty more where this came from. Stay tuned for our upcoming videos where we'll tackle other interesting financial topics like the best investment strategies, understanding the stock market, and how to make your money work harder for you. As always, we're thrilled to have you as part of our Investing Iguana community. Your support helps us keep producing free content like this. Remember, every like, share, and subscribe goes a long way. Thanks for joining us today. Keep investing, keep growing, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.